moving inventory for 71 Oldham Avenue on the 6th of February 2020. You've got blue and green bins, got a black, black gate. Good condition, the wood, wood panels also in good condition, been painted. Okay, I'm just heading to the front area. So we've got no weeds in the path. And the gate closes fine. So no weeds in the pathway clean condition no rubbish and the gardens you can see so it is has been maintained and um, there's no overgrown bushes or trees but weeds are visible very low so it's just best to keep on top of them before they do outgrow so you can see on this side the panels are turning green in some areas but majority of them have been painted. So you've got a black step, good condition. The windows have been cleaned from the inside and out. Window frames also been cleaned with no concerns, no dust, mold or damp. So the door is brown, marked in places just where paint's peeled, but there's no damage. You do have a cobweb in the arch, but clean condition. So you've got gold fittings, with your glasses all clean, with no concerns. So as soon as you enter, this is brand new flooring. So it is lino grey, again, brand new, newly fitted. There's no dirt, no damp, no damages, zero marks. Then on the door, so the door locks fine. Chain is all secure, and you do have another lock at the bottom. So there is no damage. Freshly varnished, well, I don't think it's, no, it's not freshly varnished. It is varnished, but there are some few marks in places. Glass is clean at the top with no damage, no concerns. I'm going to go straight into the living room and then I'll do the hallway. So you have your original wooden doors in place. They're with no damage. Paint is starting to peel and you do have a few black scuff marks towards the bottom, but... They're not dusty and they're not damaged. With white handle, close is fine. So behind the door, it is clean again with no damage, but you can see along the side, nails. But again, it is the original door that was first put into the property. And then you've got a couple of nails here to keep this section together. But again, no damage or concerns. Ceiling is white, clean, with no cobwebs, no stains, no leak marks, freshly painted. So I'm just going to do another angle. So you can see it's clean, with no cobwebs, no stains, no cause for concern. The coving all around is also clean and white. Light fitting, clean, working, with no dust, all light bulbs present. So if I go closer, you'll see there's no cobwebs, no dust. Okay, so I'm going to start the walls. I'll start on the bottom half. The, this property, so this room, has been completely painted. So there's zero marks on the walls, zero handprints, zero paint peeling, with no concern. Skirt boards also painted, clean condition. You've got a cove with letters, which obviously shall we shall remove. Again, it is, has been used, but there is no damage and it's fully functional. That's inside. So you see the doors are clean with no concerns. And around, you'll see there's no black scuff marks or damage. And they do close together. So you'll see there's no damage. You've got a feature fireplace, which is clean with no cause for concern. There's no damage, good condition. There is a slight thin layer of dust on the fireplace itself. And the 
the top. It's clean. It does have very few marks as well. So it's just general wear and tear marks in places. Little scratch there, little dot. So again, very, very fine marks which have been noted. So the left, it's clean with no pen marks, no hands, no prints, good condition. And the cove left of the fireplace, it's gonna do all of this. You can see each shelf is clean, glass is in place with no concerns, freshly painted above. So I'm gonna open this up. So inside is clean and ready to use. Again, the door's closed fine with no concern. Wall opposite the window, it's clean, freshly painted, zero marks. The radiator is clean with no rust or damage. Rear of the door leading into the kitchen, same as the first door, traditional and the original door. No marks or damage. This actually looks varnished to me, um, but there's no prints, there's no concerns, white handle. Obviously that's been left open because it has been varnished. So just moving on, you've got to see the beading and the wall and the skirting board. You can see it's clean, white, with no concerns, good condition. So I'm just gonna go round. So this is the top half. So you get to see again, it's still in the same condition as the bottom. It's freshly painted with no issues above the kitchen door. No handprints, no scuff marks. You do have a nail in the wall. And above the fireplace, it's clean with no concerns. Again, freshly painted, zero marks. Freshly painted in a nice white color. So obviously if marks do appear, then you can um, look into that. So you've got your window, which is bay with brand new net curtains. And then the wall, as soon as you enter, it's clean with no issues. So you can see the windows are all clean with no concerns. I'm just gonna go up and down the windows and the window frame. You get to see the windowsill too, so it's clean. Windowsills, no dust, there's no dirt, there's no damage. So if there's no mould, there's nothing to be concerned about. <clears throat> the flooring, so the flooring is laminate. Now there's no damage to the laminate, nothing's tired looking or uplifting. It could just do with a hoover. So different angle showing you that it's still, it's clean. There's no concerns about it. You can ready to move in, but like something just like in that corner could just do with a hoover. Okay, we're going to head into the kitchen. Okay, so ceiling is white, clean, freshly painted with no stains, no leak marks, no grease. Just going to move over so you get to see different sections and all corners. So it's clean with no stains, no cobwebs hanging down. You've got one, two, three, four light bulbs, all working and present with no dust or cobwebs around the light fitting. Um, okay, I'm gonna do the units first. Okay, so the worktop is clean. I'll just zoom in. Worktop is clean with a white sealant. Unit is also clean with no concerns and above, including the extract fan, on external side, all clean with no concerns. You also get to see the tiles, that they're clean with no grease marks, no damages. And I'll see the worktop and the sealant, all clean with no concerns. Worktop has been cleaned and ready to use. And the cooker is a cooker work, freestanding, and it's clean, so you have your grill, which has no grease, no leftover food, no crumbs, excellent condition. 
and then the oven at the bottom is clean with no grease marks no stains no leftover food um, just the bottom could do with an extra clean but it's ready to use you can see the shelves are clean with no concern I'm just going to close it so external you can see it's clean with no concern left of the oven so you do have spare light bulbs but this unit and obviously gas safe certificates this unit is clean and empty and closes fine underneath clean and empty open and closes fine left of the extractor fan empty and clean just gonna plug it in light bulbs both working and you can see the filter is brand new and clean so like even this it's not greasy to touch it's not sticky it's in good condition unit above the extractor fan empty and clean and then right of the extractor fan again empty and clean this is just my items that i'm just going to remove Okay, just carrying on the worktop. You can see it's clean with a white sealant. There's no burn marks, there's no damages. Sink and the windowsill's clean with no dust or dirt or burn marks. Sink is clean, ready to use. Left tap, oh, press it the wrong way. The left tap's clean and working. Right tap, which is the cold tap. Clean and working, so it drains fine. The sink's clean with no leftover food. And you've got a clear white, clear sealant, it's not white, a clear sealant running along the windowsill. And the remaining worktop clean with the remaining line of tiles. Unit under the sink is clean and empty. Area underneath the sink is presentable with no concern. Again, clean and empty. You've got a Bush freestanding washing machine, white with a tray, good condition, with no dents, no, so if I do this, it's clean with no hairs or dirt. Inside is clean with no mould or damp. So, so I'm just gonna leave the door open just to ventilate it. Unit left of the washing machine, external, excellent. You do have though, the strip that's starting to peel, so we just need to keep an eye on that. And you can see it's starting to peel in this corner here. This is the tray, which is clean, no concerns, and ready to use. Empty, it does make a bit of a, the tray might be a little bit loose, so this one here may be a little bit loose, but there's no concerns. And then right off the cooker, top drawer, empty and clean, with no dirt or grease. So all the handles that I've touched, they're clean. So it's not greasy, it's not, um, no cause for concern, and obviously that's how we expect the property to be returned to us. Um, you've got a window which is double, clean from the inside and out, with the frame white, with no concerns. So there's no cobwebs, there's no mould, there's no damp, good condition. Obviously you've got your boiler in the corner. Um, I'll just do this unit, so left of, right of the boiler, single unit clean again clean nice to touch it's not greasy good condition you just have this section here which is starting to to peel i'm going to do the i'll do the wall starting from this side so you can see the skirting boards are clean with no dust so if i just get closer they're all clean with no dust no marks good condition this is underneath and then this wall, all this kitchen, ceiling, flooring, um, the walls have all been painted and new. So you can see there's no grease marks, no cobwebs hanging down, no splashes. Really good condition, really, really impressed. It's all clean and obviously that's how it needs to maintain. So no grease marks above the extractor van, no cobwebs. And then left of the kitchen units, clean condition. Just a bit of paper that was just peeled here. And you can see, look at the skirting boards, they're clean with no dust or marks. Right off the door, including door frame, 
and above the door you can see it's clean with no concerns. Left of the door and the door frame, clean condition. Then you can see silver fitting for the light. To the bottom half you can see it's clean with no handprint, zero marks, freshly painted, really, really impressed with the current condition. In the middle of the wall. Inside the little cove is clean with no black scuff marks, no handprints, no damage. Skirt and boards, if I just come over here, you can see that they're clean with no dust or damage. And above the little section, it's clean. So again, freshly painted with no black scuff marks, no handprints, no cause for concern. And you do have a top shelf there, which is clean and ready to use. And then the section heading out into the rear area. So again, ceilings clean, white with no concern, no cobwebs, no black scuff marks. Left wall clean with no black scuff marks, no handprints, no damage, no general wear and tear marks, good condition. And you've got your black door heading into the garden with a gold fitting, we're just going to turn the angle. You've got one bolt at the bottom, a lock in the door and another bolt. But you can see around the door it's clean with no cobwebs, no dirt, no damage, excellent condition. So the right hand side, clean condition wall, freshly painted with no concerns, no pen marks, no damage from furniture. The only mark you have is this. That's the only mark. You can actually see, oh, again, it's just a cosmetic, nothing to do with yourself, that there is a line of where the paper underneath joins. But apart from that, it's clean with no concerns. So even if I zoom in on the skirting board, you'll see that there's, let it focus. No, let me zoom in. As you can see, there's no dust, no skirting boards, concerns, no black scuff marks, excellent condition. So the flooring, again, is brand new, same as the hallway. Grey lino with no damage, no tears, no cause for concern. Clean with no grease marks, it's not sticky to walk on. Again, brand new, zero marks. Just going to do it at a different angle. So you get to see it's done all in the middle, around the side. So an empty space here, it's all clean. It's not damaged or marked from any furniture. So for example, a washing machine or a dishwasher. Good condition. So I'm going to do the rest of the property before I head outside. So I'll go back to the hall. Okay, so I'm just back in the hallway. So I'll do the ceiling in the hallway first. So you can see it's white, clean, with no concerns. No cobwebs hanging down, no black scuff marks. And that is your meter box, which obviously I'll take the meter shortly. You can see one, obviously, knob is missing but that's to move the the doors side to side light bulbs working and present with no damage no cause for concern this is the light switch and then the wall in front as soon as you enter is freshly painted um so it's lining paper on underneath it looks like um, a neutral color which is attached securely with no concerns again no black scuff marks no handprints Good condition and then right as soon as I enter the hallway is clean with no black scuff marks no handprints really good condition right so facing the hallway so I'll do the right hand side wall first you can see it's clean with no marks the only thing I can see is the paper starting to uplift on this section so probably the length of my arm from here to here um, but apart from that it's clean freshly done with no concerns no black scuff marks or handprints 
Now left hand side, clean condition, freshly done, freshly decorated, with no black scuff marks, no handprints or cause for concern. Again, you can see the joint all the way down. So just moving forward, still the left hand side, I'm going to tilt the camera because you also get to see the skirting boards and then they're clean with no black scuff marks or um, dust. I'll just tilt the camera, so it goes all the way up, there's no damage, no cobwebs, no cause for concern. And then right hand side, going up you can see obviously there's another join in the paper that's visible but there's no black scuff mark, there's no damage, and it's all been freshly done. Obviously, going down here, you get to see the skirting boards are white and clean, and they've been painted. So I'm going to concentrate on the carpet first. So the carpets are in good condition. They're not damaged or they're not tear. They're just slightly stained in places. But again, they're not black scuff marks. Um, it would be an idea just to keep taking your shoes off every time you go, do go up the stairs so they don't get worse. And they've all been hoovered. Obviously, they are starting to turn black in the corners. So you also get to see the sides as well, that they're clean and freshly painted. So again, the carpets have been hoovered. They're just marks on some of them. I'm just looking down. Okay, so I'm just looking down. Right, left side, clean condition, no handprints, no marks, zero damage. And then right in front, there's no handprints on here, no black scuff marks, no concerns. And then straight in front, you can see obviously where the paper's joint, but there's no concerns, no cobwebs, freshly done. And then looking down right hand side, clean condition, banisters white with no damage. No concerns, going all the way up. No cobwebs hanging down. And then I'm just standing right on top, just doing in front, and you can see obviously where the paper joins. And the wall right in front of the stairs. It's clean with no handprints, no scuff marks, no damage, good condition. No damage from any furniture bringing up the stairs, it's clean. So this is the hall, um, the landing ceiling. So it's clean with no cobwebs, no stains, no marks, light bulb working and present. And obviously you can see where the paper's starting to peel. And again, paper starting to peel near the fire alarm. 